so Oxia, great cloud provider, managed services provider. As Mel said, you guys are delivering S4 now out uh, in the marketplace. So what makes Oxia sort of different and I think we'll all agree better <laughs> of course. Then, then, then what's out there, and what are you guys doing that, that's special? Yeah, thanks, Greg, appreciate it. So as Mel said, it, it really the last year or so has been about adoption, HANA adoption. Hundreds of migrations globally over the past year among our customer base alone. I think the, uh, the early adoption is behind us, the middle of the pack, it's game on, it's time for HANA, right. and, they're, and they're all trying to figure out how to get there. Uh, we're making it easier for our customers to get there. Um, but I'll tell you, from a differentiation perspective, it's really the relationship with Hitachi that's been key for us. Uh, we're actually beginning to challenge what it means, uh, some of some of the industry norms around what it means to host an SAP uh, HANA system in the cloud. Uh, you know, traditionally, the the industry will tell you that in order to be cost effective, you have to you work with a, a, a public cloud provider leveraging offshore right. resources, right? right. Uh, and, and often you have to give away some of the transparency and the control and perhaps some of the security that, that goes along with that option. But with Hitachi and Hitachi's world-class infrastructure and components that are now part of our organization, and we challenge that day in and day out. We actually go out there and provide for our customers a private cloud model with onshore resources, uh, full all-inclusive support stack beyond just infrastructure, and we do it at a price point that's lower than, than the public cloud options that are, that are out there for our customers. So they get to maintain that, that transparency and control, and our customers re rewarded us with a 98% plus satisfaction rating right. in, in 2016. So I think that's proof positive that what we're doing is actually working for them. And I'll tell you, we've relished the opportunity to, to talk with customers and prospects this week and, and to show them how we're doing that for them, how it's real and how it's very tangible. Yeah, that's really good. I mean, it sounds like uh, uh, you're taking a bit of a disruptive approach and, Absolutely. and going against the grain. You turned it yeah. on its head, right? And yeah. like you said, I think, you know, the, the era of sort of previous gen broad based shared services, you know, offshoring sort of run its course and Agreed. people are looking for a more Agreed. targeted uh, uh, artisanal hosting experience that you guys provide them.